All right, guys. Hope everybody's well. Having some good experience in this lot. We're back in our little uh, city builder game, Ostriv. I think that's how you pronounce it. If that's not how you pronounce it, I apologize, but I try my best, right? Uh, I was just reading the roadmap for the game and reading up a little bit about it. And they're talking about adding a lot of, a lot of stuff to the game, actually. Prime, justice, <laughs> uh, more crops, graphics and performance, obviously. More weather effects, cats and dogs. Uh, private businesses, okay. Like a police station and stuff like that. Better tree models. Uh, uh, there's a huge, huge list. Goes on and on. As a developer said, it looks like there's uh, one developer developing this game, and he's from the Ukraine, actually. Uh, yeah, all my prayer and all my prayers and all that goes out to the Ukraine by what they're going through. So uh, let's get back into our little game, yeah? We'll put some music on. Let some music running bad background. Alright. Oh, way over here in the trees, mate. <laughs> Alright. Big pine tree right there. Yeah, let's pull out of there. Uh, I think on the last episode we kind of did this little, these little, started building houses over here, trying to get a street built up. Yeah, cool. Trying to get our population up a little bit more. I do have to keep an eye on everything because uh, we don't want to run out of food, right? <laughs> We got 490 potatoes to harvest so far. Let's see, why aren't you full? He's pushing firewood and wood. All right. Let's, uh, Let's build another one, right? Never, uh, you never have too much friggin' firewood and stuff, bro. We'll push that up the old thing a little bit. Now, this thing looks massive, don't it, dude? At <laughs> the brewery. I got the eye of the tiger, 
Uh, now they want to sell us some potatoes. Not bad, 300 bucks. Uh, oh, they're demanding that. Never mind, sorry. So that's their demands of what they want, and this is what they're offering to sell us. Uh, we're gonna buy the food. Okay, so we need to fix this, right? Well, thank you. Um, we had a lot of fun filming this, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys for your support. We love you. Ben Buckwake, maybe? Would that work? You know what I mean? I don't really know how many it takes before it needs uh, filling again on the uh, flex. We definitely have too many farms on this one friggin' or too many fails on one farm. <laughs> That's insane, dude. Let's see, uh, let's see what's up here. So we got 2,000 apples stored. Now we can... I think we can drive fruit now, right? Uh... How you do that, I really don't know. I just wanna keep calling your name until you come back home. Just wanna keep calling your name until you come back home. I'm assuming he's getting a bark. Yeah, cool. Yeah, cool. We grabbed 2,000 bark. Now, I did see dry fruit because one of our villagers was selling it to us, right? Them apples don't have a line on it. Like, can apples go bad? Not really sure. I feel crazy. I see you around me. All these empty faces. All that, all that, and every day I've been looking sad. Now, are you boys okay over here? It looks like uh, something's being delayed, if you know what I mean, right?
Saka A lot of people waiting around, right? Turn our music down just a little bit. Uh, Balance Avenue guys, they do a lot of covers and stuff. If you uh, never heard of them, you should go uh, check them out, man. They got a great vocal. Now, let's see here. They got this. Get these boys chopping some wood up. Yeah, they're they're doing their thing. And I guess we go ahead and half it. Might need a cart shed down here. Do we have one already? We do not. Or is it back there? Oh, it is one back there. Sorry, my bad, my bad. Yeah, cool, cool. Nice. Oh, we got people living in here now. Wow. Oh, they just moved in? Yeah, they did just move in, didn't they? They're getting wood and stuff and bringing it in there. <laughs> oh. Well, it turned that ugly brown color when I did that, didn't it? See it? Well, here comes the snow and boys, so all you boys can drop off. Go help out other places that we need. But well, they didn't get all this, uh, all these, like some of the friggin' stuff still laying there on the ground, dude. On the farms, eh? Oh, oh what's up with that? Uh. I only have two builders, so... That's not the problem, it's just... We just need more people. Hey, and Fairwood, huh? So hay won't fit in there, but firewood will. So we need one of them small granaries over here, right?
What else? Water. Got a wheel pot. This is our salt work, so yeah, we're just trying to give them everything they need. Where they don't just go everywhere, you know what I mean? Like if they have to travel all the way over there to get the hay and bring it all the way back. It's a bit inconvenient, right? Oh yeah, now we can fix these, right? From not having so many. should help my face above the water and my feet can't touch the ground touch the ground and it feels like I can see the sands on the horizon every time we've just been given a loan how come we've been given a loan for Did we go bankrupt or something? Hmm. We're in the good, right? Lock. Our expenses. Import. We need to tax the rich. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Taxing the rich, man. They don't lock it. They can move out. You know, someone else can come in and live. <laughs> yeah. The small granary gun. Now, how are you boys going on the building? And we'll just go and get in our construction office and we can actually add more builders to it. Then that way we get some uh, stuff on the rail right? Is our hay still looking good? Looks full to me, eh? Chicken farm okay? Looks pretty good. We got another cow thing too. Nothing wrong with a good stack, right? How for how big can I actually make it, dude? Oh my god. Why make it huge? Why not? How can I love when 
Now, can I move one of our bulls down here? See, that boy's nine years old. We don't want to protect him anymore, right? We protect... Some of the other ones that's young, yeah? And the young ones in. The 12-month-old right there, too. We'll pop protection on him. Now, if we can get, uh, there goes our sheep. Uh, still try to sell our charcoal, but it's. Kind of hard to sell the charcoal. <laughs> it's like selling people ice in the middle of, uh, you know, Antarctic. <laughs> yeah, they don't go for it too much. Two thousand buck weight. We have fifteen hundred apples. Got dried fruit, but all that's gone now. Honey. Seventeen hundred potatoes, pumpkins. Tons of firewood. So we look pretty good, man. Let's just jack it up three, speed it down, and just let them build away, right? Oh, we got a message here, so let's see what's going on with this first. So this is what they demand. This is what they want. This ain't how much we have in our... Uh, that number ain't how much we got. I thought it was. Could buy some cows. Fill our cow pan up. Uh, let's see here. We bought. Wow, that's a lot, dude. That's that's a eight hundred bucks. Well. Wow. I'm gonna go. What, five bulls maybe that's 600 bucks I can't love with that uh I don't know how many clothes we have we was selling clothes at one point but I think they went down because our flex income went down. Uh, yeah, we don't even have any clothes in stock, man. Well, yeah. No selling that to him, eh? Hey? Uh, 
So I'm hoping the uh, stuff picks up a little bit better, right? Took the clothes from there, so people are still building clothes. Like when I add a few more. I think everybody would be on the forums though, right? Oh, they're coming in. Is that full? So we got to remember we got three on there, right? So when things get a little too crazy, springtime hits, we take them all out, yeah? Let them go to the farming. So we need another uh, warehouse for bricks, charcoal, and quick lime. Get it, uh, get it up and going, right? Might actually put it here. Alright, nobody's way, is it? Nah. Perfect, dude. I hope our clothes go up a little bit then. Yeah, yeah, we got ten. <laughs> They're going like fire, dude. Like, yeah. Uh, I would like to have two in there, to be honest, but. We kind of need them here in our farming, yeah? Then we'll swap back. What's her weight lot? Is it going up? No, it's only 40 right now. We'll just let that set. There goes our cows. Looking good, looking good. So it doesn't matter how big that pasture is, still can only hold 20. It's interesting, hey? Because we just wasted all this. And we would have to destroy it to get it to work. Okay, we'll get these chickens seem to be working out for us too, so Got the warehouse built. This is going down, so maybe we just dedicate this to uh, bricks. Yeah, these boys are tearing it up, man. 
<laughs> they want that brewery built. <laughs> Pretty big though, I think it takes a while to build it. They're pushing pretty hard on it. Oh, buy my man, hey? Gotta get the pub up and going, shoot. We gotta put two in there. Oh well, gotta be done, right? It's the brewery. I don't think no one's gonna complain uh, that too many people's over there working in a brewery, right? <laughs> okay, so we need water, firewood and hops what is the other thing uh so you don't need barley right or do you have to have barley as well to make it maybe we do We'll check back in with that. That work? Oh no, we don't have a worker in there. Oops. I should have filled it up before I did that. Dang it. It's my fault, man. My fault. Come on, guys. Come on. They're dying on us. <laughs> uh, someone's taking a break. Now the chickens are dying, dude. Not time. Not a good time for a coffee break. Come on. So, uh, let's let these boys take a break out here if they want to, right? They're going all the way home. Couple trays. Oh, you're not going to take there, right? So he's full. Okay, firewood. And uh, just, just wood. Oh, 
Yeah, cool. Nice man. What's our crops looking like now? Gotta let them boys do their thing. Got a ton of potatoes growing in, right? Refills, potatoes. And we got boat weight. This would be potatoes next. And boat weight. Rot. Nice. Uh, now I think you can get plows in this game as well. Where they can plow to fill. Uh, how to get that? Uh, yeah, I don't know yet, mate. Turn all them on. Another carpenter to that. Having a look at all the settings. Everybody. What do we, how many people we got? 212, hey? Alright, let's pull back on the uh, builders. And pop uh, a couple of these guys in. Uh, Fishing, eh? Little towns. <laughs> Go on, eh? Yeah, there's got a half a mark. Now we're just looking for barley then, right? So we gotta have barley and hop, by the looks of it. So we might change this. Well, barley looks pretty harsh. Was that 50? And weights. Then we go barley and then a feller. Yeah. Say something, I'm giving up on you. So I have no barley for him to actually do anything yet. Do we? Look, he's not actually making anything because he need barley and hop to make beer. Yeah, so these boys are just... Let's get them out of there for now until we get some barley going. Did they give us another loan? Why are we getting a loan for? Are we going like bankrupt or something? Does it automatically do that? Well, some more weight's going up. But wait, charcoal. 
Just let them start planting away, hey? Or harvesting? Blowing the potatoes up. Maybe we should add another person to this. Because these people get hammered, right? I think we're going to be alright in food. Famous last words, eh? So let's just keep adding, uh, adding some more housing, yeah? Population, mate. We just need population. Got too many jobs that we need done. fish I don't see one in there do you drinking water man there's a lot of friggin people out here fishing dude I guess because it takes a while to draw the fish. Do we have any more opens for builders? Should just look here, right? No. So zero, actually. Is that in two of them? This is jumping up and down. Hey, <laughs> uh, give me another one. Okay, let's just load it up. This is looking for a job zero, zero, zero. Um, how's our uh, school teacher backed up? We need another. We need another school. Got to get another school going, man.
Looks good enough for me right there, right? Turn it just... Doesn't want to line up properly with that. <laughs> That's all right. We don't have that much SAD, do we? Sorry, I just want to check. There, yeah. Okay, right there. Yeah. Cool. We're happy with that. We're demanding nothing we have for sale. I got warm clothes. How much is warm clothes? 900. Oof. Uh, what about 280 bucks, man? Uh, 500. $200. We'll take 500 clothes, warm clothes. All right, we're uh, what are you doing? Soul is exhausted. Okay. We should be able to do two weeks, though, right? And then back. Uh, yeah, it gets a bit, well, I don't want, need all you guys on there. <laughs> Not showing where our cows, kind of scares me when I say that. I think everybody's died. <laughs> okay, okay, boys. Assuming they can go until it freezes over, right? Just shows I'm going back. Okay, cool. Now I wonder, salting fish. So you you do need someone in there. To salt the fish. I did not know that. So if we keep one person on it, they will salt the fish with it. Cool, and we'll just take one dude in there. Wow. Had too many, man. Too many people right there, right? And I do have horses. Now, I wonder, is that how you get plows? Like, you need a horse to pull it? I thought an ox would pull it, though. So all of our beef 
is like going like hotcakes, dude. And all of our, ch we got 10 chicken meat, but still. <laughs> It looks like the population loves beef and chicken and yeah, milk. I don't think you can get enough of that stuff by the looks of things. I wish I would have half that, but what I'm thinking, I'll build one here, transfer them over into it. Demolish this wheel and then redo it. Uh, that's our sheep pasture. I'm assuming that's mutton, right? That comes from sheep. Alright, keep letting them boys dry the fish then. Maybe that's maybe that's what we was doing wrong, eh? Hey? Coming back to work now. You could see the dry fish popped up there when he did that. Got dry fish in there. It looks like it's working now, right? We got 40 dry fish now. What I was doing wrong. I didn't keep them in there. Hey, X Red, how you doing, man? Sorry, I didn't see you come in, man. Get into this little game. <laughs> I should put some alerts up, eh? Something. Uh, how many we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Six. I kind of want another form as well. I want to try to get our weight up higher. That's all. Uh, I might turn it around this way since it's going to be for that one. Do something like that, right? Then we'll go I wish you could see the ghost a little bit better uh, you know the flags are there but it's really hard to see 
Yeah, looks like it's there somewhere. Well, it's not gonna line up perfect, but that's all right. We don't mind. I'd love to get it somewhat close, but. <laughs> it's saying something's, oh, we're too close to it. Never mind. Yeah. It's friggin' hard to see it, man. I guess we'll, we'll just pop it here, right? Pop. And if I hit that right, it's going to not let me do it. We'll just do that. That's cool. Now. Everybody should be sowing fields right. Got a ton of people down here doing it. I might actually take a few of our builders away, actually. Because I prefer to have them working in our, uh, helping to sow crop and stuff like that. Then we can swap them back to it. Maybe I got that a little tight I <laughs> fence there, eh? I don't even know if they can walk between that or not. They may can. We'll see, uh, we'll see what happens, eh? He's going all the way down there. Oh, he's working in his private garden, right? Okay, you do your thing, man. So he's going over there to sit on a bench. So that just tells us. Need to pop some benches out on his work area, right? Try to stop that. We can have a little smoke out there if you want, right? A little break. So going all the way home. Here. This, uh... We'll put a friggin' apple tree out here, hey? That way he might eat the apples as well if it gets a little hungry. <laughs> Yeah, so walking all the way home. Yeah, nice. And I wonder if we could put some benches out here for him as well. No sense of walking all the way home to take a break, hey? When I can just pop out here and take a little break. They just want a little break. When we're out here working in the fields. Takes a takes a minute to uh, decorate some stuff, but uh, I 
because you get so uh, tied up with organization, right? But we do have it maxed all the way up on three, right? So we're getting another church, or uh, sorry, another school built. Because uh, our teacher was uh, overloaded, man, with kids, right? Like a slap full, man. Got to get, gotta get another, another school going. Might pop another one down here over time, right? For this little suburb that we're building. So we got it's jumping four to five, four to five men. What's up? One. Let's so add them to the fishing thing, right? How many is that? I don't know how fast the updates are, how true the update is, right? Now it says zero, zero. Open vacancies. Uh, up and down, up and down, up and down. Yeah. <laughs> it's running pretty good. I don't know why they keep giving us a loan for, like, are we going bankrupt or something? Our expenses is 1668 Our income is 2395 so... I guess we notch it up a couple more on everything. Then if uh, people start complaining about uh, wages or whatever. Uh, it's going up now. Up and down, up and down. Look, I have it squeezed as much as possible out of this shit. I haven't really uh, tinkered with it that much, to be honest. Our farms are looking great this season, hey? I guess her milk would finally start going up soon, won't it? Out. 
80. Because I was thinking about getting, uh, you know, getting the cheese and dairy and... All that good stuff going. We haven't actually did anything with it. Butter and all that. So that's maxed out now. So we've got another cow shed right there. And what we'll do is we'll we'll make it as half as small as this because it doesn't really matter how big it is. Then we'll transfer all them into it and then we'll demolish this and make it size it down a little bit. Cause it's just don't need to be that big. I thought the livestock limit, you know, would grow if you got the pasture bigger. That's uh, obviously not the case. Sounds, looks like our chickens are doing quite well, as long as we... Uh, keep an eye on everything, right? So it looks like we might have some barley coming in now, right? So let's see here, so we need... Uh, So hop goes into, I'm um, assuming a granary, right? Yeah, the church is going up nice, or the school. I don't know why I keep calling it a church. It's in front of the road a little bit, but that's all right. They'll just make another one around all like that. <laughs> all good, mate. All good. Hops, we have 8,000 up, so we need our barley to go up. Let's make sure we're not feeding their freaking animals barley, right? We're feeding them wheat, though. Wow. What's up? So let's take the barley away for now, right? So let's check the cows. Cows get hay, so it shouldn't be that, right? Sheep. Wow, look at all that wool in there, dude. We could sell some wool, couldn't we? Got a ton of that crap. Nice. 
Now that should help us with our barley. Because it was being sowed, man. Or being fed to the chickens. So we should be able to... Uh, What do we get? We get like a small granary in here, right? And then I think we're going to need a warehouse here as well. We'll get them two lined up. What else do we need here? So hot uh, water. So let's get a uh, let's get a well just outside the door, then, eh? Pop it right there. They got barley, we're buying it. No, but they got glass. We don't have no window glass yet. Hmm. I haven't looked at how much it's going to take to make window glass yet. Put it at if we shipped it in. Yeah, we need all of our bricks to go in there, so we... Well, and that's where our uh, forestry, so we don't really want to mess with that. And that's full. Yeah, kind of running out of where to put it. We could put it over here where the salt salt works is. This needs hay, right? How you don't go in the granary? I don't see it anywhere. <laughs> Look, I know we have it, right? Like we have, we got hay, right? Yeah. Twenty-three thousand of hay, right? Like we got twenty-three thousand of it. 
Oh, it has to be stored in them hay things. Hay barracks things, right. Mm, so this granary was not needed. Okay, you can, we'll take that off then. Yeah, I forgot about that. Hey, Drawn. Yep. Uh, well, I'm missing that thing. Hey, what's it called? <laughs> I wish you could just uh, search it. Do you know what I mean? Like that. That would be cool. Like if it had a search bar. Alphabetical order, maybe? In the hay, where the hay is, maybe? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh. I must be glancing over it or something and missing it. There goes the glass works. What does it take actually? And soap. Soap works. So you just use a uh, friggin' uh, tree bark. Yeah, we're going to look into some of this other stuff as well. Uh, there it is. Over here with trade and transport. I don't, I don't know why it's there, but okay. Yeah, okay. We'll just pop it here. You guys out there doing it up? Cool. That's our potatoes, right? Let's wait 50, right? 50%. Yeah. We should do 50 and then a follow. Yeah. Uh, 
Uh, we need some help over here, boys, on the friggin' uh, farms. Yeah, just that population, need more population. And I wish I'd let you lot like, women come and fish and work in the fishery and stuff like that. Like, I know it's supposed to be, you know, 1742, but still. They can fish. Come on. I guess it's a balancing thing. That way you'd have to balance out male and female and whatnot. Man, that thing's spinning, dude. <laughs> All right. So one of our fields is ready, and what we was wanting to jump on is uh, some of that wheat. So do you have to vice versa it like that to get it going right like that? Maybe. Doing it up, doing it up. Yeah, I'm just looking, guys. Sorry. Um, yeah, that's giving us almost 6,000 potatoes now. We got uh, 17,000 bricks. get uh, everybody to come over and help out on farming. I think our uh, I think our money is stabilizing too. Let's go up a little bit more on it, right? One more. And lower the wedges a little bit. Let it going up, not down, right? <laughs> it's holding at seven sixty-seven seventy, and no one wants to buy charcoal. Like that's just like no one wants it. And we got a ton, dude. Like, I'm talking about a ton of charcoal. How much is the glass? Well, 300. Now that's a rub. Let's, uh, got a little screw up and going. Your teacher in there, male or female, we don't care. I'm 
Will they start teaching our kids? <laughs> you knew that? Got the warm clothes on? Sure. No shoes. I don't know why we got we got some nosh. We got tons of shoes, right? Now we got six hundred shoes out there, man. We're walking around barefooted for, eh? You guys get the fills done? I think they come pretty close. If not. Yeah, they seem alright. They seem alright. Alright, let's get these boys all for fishing. But we leave one in there. Oh, do, is that all we have is one in there? Okay, fair enough. So we're good there. Isaiah will salt our fish in there for us. Oh. Yeah, we just have to get the... Uh, Get these boys on the ball, eh? I wonder if we could put some of that friggin' wood in here, eh? Man, look at all that charcoal. Jesus. Let's put... Put some down here as well. Oh, we got a thousand shoes up for market here on the boat. Get some of that wood out of storage, you're lacing that way, huh? Yeah, I guess we'll move this down because them, that wood, the wood boys need to uh, take care of the wood there, of course. I guess we put everybody on building this winter time, get the building boys. Check them all the way up. We're looking okay though, like we're getting. Everything we need to survive is what I'm saying. No one's done. No one's dead, so that's good. We got tons of apples, uh, 500 butt weight. 38,000 firewood. No one's going to be cold. You know what I mean? Tons of hay. I still don't know what's going on with our barley. Over 6,000 uh, potatoes. Are they still feeding it to the animals? I hope not.
I prefer him to give the uh, the butt weight to him, to be honest. Yeah, nice boys. Good on you. <laughs> oh, well. All in line up. Okay. It's a little small guy right here, but we got a ton of friggin' uh, builders. Like, it looks like our mate just gets sewed so quick, man. But we don't have nothing in storage. Like, that chicken and beef and, you know, mutton. That go, it, it just goes like hotcakes, man. Everybody just grabs it. We have our fish down here, right? Oh, we got some chicken and beef down here as well, waiting, but mainly it's all fish. Because, uh, hey, we can't keep enough beef in there, man. Well, they just friggin' love that beef, man, but, uh, you know, who does look like a big, nice, fat steak, though, right? I don't think these farms need to be that big, actually. You can just, uh... Make them like that. You doing your job? Cool, man, cool. So, if I make this empty... I don't think it works that way. Maybe we have to do it like this. Move them out like that, maybe? Relocating some of them. They're relocating. And then we'll take up. Uh, we'll destroy this field and make it and half it up. It's too big. Doesn't need to be. I sure don't need to be that big, man. I wish it would show them in the winter time as well, but it just, it doesn't even show you have any animals there.
So we got an oil workshop as well. I don't know what we use oil for, I guess. Uh, for cooking or something? We'll have to, uh, we'll have to try to work some of it out. We're making soap, eh? I guess we should make some soap, right? <laughs> we don't want everybody all stinking and stuff all the time, right? Yeah. It takes cow fat by what it says, so we'll pop it here. Uh, here comes springtime around. I was looking at uh uh the roadmap to this game and it had so many things that the the developer wants to do. Looks very promising, man. Uh He's got some really great ideas, right? Like, he's going to add a lot of stuff to the game as well. It's going like to be a beautiful little game when he gets through with it. Which it, it, it is now, I think. But, you know, just better. So, what are we thinking about adding some more houses, eh? Maybe we go give him a, you know, right here. Make a little straight right there. Let it go through here. Now I'm assuming we could pull this back. Yeah, sorry man, didn't mean to pull you that hard back. Just in case they want to come down through here as well. Now we do have a glass workshop too. I don't know what that needs. Glass is usually sand, right? Uh, it's probably not that simple, though. Okay, so we just need to get him some hay in here, right? Get a few dryers out around it. Hey, dryers. Uh, oh, I thought that was in there, dude. Right there? 
No, you're not happy? So maybe that will fill that up for him and then we can get more of our salt work. Work's going a little bit better. Now, and let's just put the salt in here. Nice. Cool, man. We got salt, firewood, hay. And you got your water right there, so that's set up pretty good. Uh, now I'm thinking about putting some houses in here as well, maybe. For people who work at the salt works and all that stuff, even for the farmers, I guess, right? Wouldn't that be cool to live out here on the farm? <laughs> Get a couple uh, houses back up in the woods here. Shoot. Uh, we don't have a lot of markets over here. Like, like we don't have a market close by, but... Uh, If it gets too bad, uh, I hit the wrong button. God dang it. We'll build a little market over here for him, hey? Like butt wheat, potatoes, and all that good stuff's right here, man. Goes right there. Like that's where they unloaded at. So, I don't want to turn it. That way it's not straight. But right there, when them boys get time, they can cut that loose. Couple of houses. Hay dryers out here. Oh, that's not level terrain, is it? Okay, that's cool. I might take uh, them hay things up, actually. Since that's the case, because... Pretty sure you can build them on unlevel terrain, right? Yeah, it doesn't matter, they don't even care. So we'll see how these uh, families go out here. Yeah. You guys are uh, getting filled up there, aren't you? Uh, 
Uh, we'll see what this thing needs, right? We'll get our, uh, we'll get our, uh, little village some soap in there, yeah? Get them smelling right. Well, it'll smell good, hey? Get the oil works going up soon, yeah? Get a little bit of oil in your hair. A little bit of soap under your arm. Shoot. Nice little town to live in. We uh, we'll think about popping some houses around here as well, eh? Out in the country here. If we can get some level terrain, I think we can pop some in here. We'll give them their own little uh, farming plots too, where they can grow their own food. There. So, let's spin you a little bit. You're crooked there, mate. That's better. Nice, man. Nice. I'm a little well out here. We got nice fresh water to drink. Yeah, got all this food. People that work in the butchery and on the farms and stuff like that. And I, I don't know what this line is. I think it's a glitch, but that's all right. Now, we want all our barley going here, mate. All of it if they can. Uh, we're either... We're going to take it from the other granaries as well. Because we've got to get that beer up and going, right? The boys, uh, the boys are gonna love that. Fade it up a little bit here. Didn't realize I had it so slow. Yeah, yeah, man. There's another one coming. We hope. There we go. How can I love when I'm afraid to? We still have all them builders, so all good, mate. Everybody's chilling. Hey, is she allowed to work? Us? She's 17. Good on her.
You barely can't get the 17-year-old kids these days to take out the friggin' garbage from all the grass. Well, longer I work out in the fields, eh? <laughs> We worked a little fun fact about Bear Claws, guys. Uh, I lived with my grandfather and grandmother out on uh, 300, we had about 300 acres of farmland. Uh, we, have a, we had a river, it wasn't that close, like it, it was back in there. But when you're a kid, that river is just a rock throw away, yeah? Uh, like you could go out and you can hunt and fish, uh, swim. Uh, we'd go out and help grandfather chop all the trees and get, gather all the firewood. And, uh, the guy that actually owned the farm, he had people from around the areas would come in and handpick uh, the produce. And I would go out there and I would pick watermelons and bales of hay and we had okra, squash, uh, uh, we had chicken farms. You went and picked up eggs, clean, help clean the eggs, and and uh, he would pay us like as as a kid. I think I was like twelve years old, eleven, twelve years old, and I'd go out there and I'd work all week in the farm on the farm, and. And the and the farmer that owned all that, he would pay you money. It wasn't much, like a, But the lifestyle was priceless. You know what I mean? It was. It was a. Uh, it was great fun, man. Great fun. Uh, the one thing that it taught me is if you wanted something, you go out and you work for it. No one was going to give you nothing in this world, yeah? That's how I bought my first gun, my hunting rifle. That's how I bought my first bicycle, my first fishing pole. I went out and I worked for it. No one give it to me. <laughs> uh, I think, uh, I just think uh, people are a little bit more spoilt these days and something is taken away from them from, because of that. And uh, for that, lifestyle and living that I lived all the way I was up to 15 years old I guess that's that's why I like playing this little game because it takes me back to that when I when I see this like uh, I think in my mind this is the way humanity should live Uh, off the land, you know what I mean? Like, uh, it wasn't no, uh, if you wanted meat or food, you didn't go down to the shops and buy it in plastic, wrapped up in plastic. You'd go out and you'd hunt, kill it, butcher it, bring it home, uh, feed the free, uh, fill the, fill the freaking uh, fridge up or the deep freezer. You know what I mean? 
<laughs> it just, uh, it taught you that, and that was a great thing, you know what I mean? It wasn't bad. Teaches you a lot of uh, self-discipline. Yeah, great times, man. Really great times. Wouldn't ask for no other way. If I could go back in time, best raising in the whole wide world, man. Loved it. Let's, uh, how are we going here? I think we're doing great, yeah? That firewood is going crazy, man. I think I might actually turn it down, to be honest. Uh, we'll drop it down to 2,000. That ain't gonna hurt nobody, right? I mean, we got. Forty-three thousand. <laughs> We're not gonna run out anytime soon. I wish I could sell some of it. Eh? None of it. They don't want nothing. No firewood. No shoes. No nothing. I got some horses. I'm assuming we need to build stables and whatnot for them though, right? Look. I'm assuming we don't have any wheat at this time. So we'll drop them boys all from there. See, can I get somebody to work in this soap shop, eh? Soap works. Take a couple off a building, maybe? No? Not, still not happy? There we go. We need to All right. What did they grab? Oh, they got the fat. Not enough law. But I got you, baby. Baby, I don't need dollar bills to have fun. I thought we was making that. Baby, I don't need dollar bills to have fun tonight. And I don't need no money. As long as I can feel the beat. I don't need no money. Hmm. It's quick law. Wow, ah, works right there, right? So what do we do? Jack this up. Says we have 500 somewhere.
Oh, that's checked all the way up. Crap. Uh, that's a long walk, isn't it? <laughs> Can we uh, just put some there? Get people just constantly working on it? Oh, it's slap full. That's not gonna work then, is it? Wait, this ain't. So if we just go. Yeah. Go get it, Rock Boys. Oh, that's that's What do you make lie out of? Is that I'm trying to work it out. That's Ash, right? Yeah, that's ash and water, right? Pretty sure. Yeah, that's it right there. So we need an asher as well. Alright, let's spin this around. Yeah, I figured there would be a catch to it, right? Of that I'm sure she smiled at me on the subway. She was with another man. But I won't lose no sleep on No, not we won't. Yeah, water and ash. What does it take? What do you feel it with? Free bark. Okay. Mm. All three of those are full lined. And not one ounce of bark in there. We gotta get some bark in here, man, for this. So, we'll get a warehouse going. Well, spinning around, pop it on right behind it like that. I don't know if I've been collecting bark, I can't remember. Cause what you know, like I was saying, well, what are we gonna need bark for, really? Our money's going up. That's nice. Oh yeah, I figured you'd have some trouble over here. So, but wait and step her up. So we're gonna get you to have a. Uh, now let's have a think of this. We got apples. We usually have tons of honey too coming in.
flower, yeah. Uh, how much card and so we have nine <laughs> nothing. So we go flower, we got apples. Up oh, there we got potatoes in there, right? Yeah, all right. Go dried fish. Just get a worker in there. Uh, yeah. Say something, I'm giving up on you. We got some apricots too. Like, yeah, we'll pop them in there as well. Our eggs is pretty steady. Yeah, I think we'll go chicken eggs to dried fish. Yeah, got you, got you. Chicken eggs, apricots, cool. I'm sorry that I couldn't get to you. Now that should help the dilemma out. Wow, where are they coming from? Oh my god. Go get some eggs and stuff. Let's see what's going on in there. Yeah, they got some apples and stuff in there, potatoes, yeah, cool. That must be their, oh, that's his mom and dad, and that's her mom and dad, and that's their kids. Wow. It's a family tree type thing. That's cool, man. Uh, look, this is where we need glass. If we get the glass works going, we can start building uh, more improved uh, building houses then. Multi-families and stuff can fit in there. Look, that might be pretty cool, huh? Uh, that song was dragging me down, dude. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, there goes our hay starting to fill up just a little bit. Yeah, nice, nice. They'll keep dropping it in there, and I'm assuming the guy's doing fish. We'll pull it down to them, right? Sheep died. What are you dying for, dude? Let's 
some libraries in there as well, and we'll look at what what's going on here. Cheap takes hay, right? There's tons of hair. Getting drunk with my friend. Nobody should be dying around here of starvation, dude. Somebody just don't reckon that I did it wrong. I was younger than should be like some sort of problem with obesity, not the other way around. Well we got tons of freaking food here. Sheep hide. How much sheep hide do we have? Mm. Uh, don't be milking them, dude. Go and get some friggin' food to give to them. There are tons of hay over there, man. Like, I don't know what's... Yeah. All good, all good. Guess we then flex. I don't know. Still trying to work out the. Uh, <laughs> still trying to work out the forms. Solo, solo. What do you use solo for? Hmm. I thought we had some of it, but I don't guess we do. Uh, Slaughter Builders back up again, I guess, eh? How you doing with food? Need to go get some of them chicken eggs. I don't know what to do about the sheep dying, man. Like, there's tons of hay over there. Like, what do you do? Like, we got 25,000 hay over there. Well, they're just not doing their job. What do you do? You know what I mean? Uh, we might take these apricots out and put firewood here, right? Bobby. Like we need firewood over here, right? For them to have firewood. But well, I got two ends here, though. <laughs> uh, no, I don't know. Where do you guys get firewood from? We do have a market there selling firewood, actually. 
Well, I want you selling fish, dude. Let's sell apples, how about that? Because all of our fish get dried. Now, did you make any beer whatsoever? actually grab any beer. I don't know if there's any beer in there or not. Am I still missing barley from here? Saying it right there, right? 59 of 500. Okay, we might have to get barley going more. Dang it, that might not be worth what it's giving us. You know what I mean? Oh, just do that, right? That'd be fun, barley. Falling, barley falling, barley falling. That's sweet. Wait, wait. Oh, maybe that's why we don't have any barley gun. <laughs> okay. All right, ladies, let's go to work, eh? You guys getting some of these? Yeah, putting them up, man. Getting some nice little houses over here. There goes our cows out. Oh, they take them in there in the winter time, and then they let them out. Yeah, they're to come out. <laughs> okay, okay. Just saving some of our bulls up. We don't want them to kill all our bulls. We'll protect them. Now, if I get him three going, that should be pretty freaking good, right? Like, is all of our sheep dead? <laughs> says they're 30 in there. Oh, no livestock. They're all died. Dude, you freaking didn't do your job, mate. Is it because there's too much wool in here, maybe? That could be the case, right? I think that's why. Sorry, sheep. I think that was my fault. Just processing too much wool. So, I think that's what you make warm clothes out of, is wool. A little bit crooked there, mate. A little bit crooked.
I mean, it doesn't have to be perfect, but yeah, that was pretty shocking, right? I don't think it'll let me line it up. It won't. Uh, I can't get it lined up straight. Is it going to look like that? Or it's going to look like that? Alright, we'll make it look like that. <laughs> Alright. So I think what happened is we don't have any more Piggy Wiggy, so you guys can uh I should have kept them in there and let them empty all that stuff out, but... So, because the storage is full, our worker wasn't allowed... He couldn't put anything... Like, no food in it. Because he had too much wool in there. So if we put wool in here to be sewed, that would be nice, right? If we could sell any of it, it'd be great. But I think you can uh, make warm clothes out of it, right? I don't know which is which here, though. Look, if I took you all the way down and went... They get sheep skin, not wool. So what the hell we make wool? Well, I, I thought you'd make warm clothes out of wool. But it looks like they're using sheepskin to do that. So that's something we'll have to look at too, because we need to get rid of some of our wool. They got sheep hides here that they want. Yeah. Um, I don't know about that. I really don't want to, uh, do something I don't know. Get rid of something that we really, really need, you know what I mean? But, uh, yeah, we definitely had enough of it, that's for sure. I can feel it slop up. Oh, they have sheep? No. We'll have to send some messages out to these uh, places and try to get some more sheep in. And we have to see what we need wool for and what we need to make with it. Uh, yeah, we're looking good, man. Look at our population. We just want to go careful on building houses because we don't want our population to grow too big, too quick.
Man, there's a lot of different food out there. I don't know what you're crying about. Got fish and eggs and chicken meat. Uh, beef is pretty rare, but <laughs> you know, we're we're trying. We're we're trying to get up in there with the beef. Uh, our milk should be going up soon. That way we can start making cheese and what else? Cheese and butter. Yeah. Yeah. I guess that's what you get when you make these little houses that don't have gardens. They don't get the variety of different foods then, you know? Like, I do try to buy them and sell them out of our markets. Like, I've been, I've been buying, uh, like, uh, peas, cucumbers, cabbage, all that stuff, beetroot, from our population and selling it back to the population. Yeah, there you go. Apricots, apples, cherries. It looks like it's zero all the way down though, doesn't it? So we might put our regular stuff in here, right? Our stuff. Our cherries and apricots and apples we'll, we'll put ours in there yeah it still says we need 450 barley to start our uh, brewery thing up so We'll let that uh we'll let that slide, eh? We'll just let that uh do its thing. But uh yeah. Uh hope you guys uh got some sort of satisfaction or entertainment out of this. Uh I have a I have a great time playing the game. It brings back memories for me. Uh, we'll pop a little save on right. And uh, be sure to look at the episodes that pop on YouTube. Do me. Do me a huge favor and just take a second out and pop a little lock on there. Makes me, uh, lets me know that people do enjoy watching it and stuff like that. And until next episode, guys, see ya.